I just Dr. Aaron Ernst, host of the Atlas Show. If you'd like to let me show you how to naturally boost human growth hormones, you can. Yeah, this Brunswick from 1939 uh, has always had that hum you heard. It uh, had it when I tested it, and I recapped it, and it still had it. So I'm just going to go back and double check everything. I replaced all the electrolytics, all the capacitors. Just wondering if there's a bad solder joint somewhere, or maybe I hooked up one of the electrolytics wrong. Something, something's causing that buzz. So far, the only thing I can think of is these two are tens, and they both are still ten when I tested them. This one was barely anything, and even when I went to discharge the voltage, these had eh, ten volts on it give or take, and this one had like a negative voltage or next to no voltage. So I'm wondering if that thing's a problem and where it ties in, where the center tap ties in right there, the line is all frayed and not a real great connection. Yeah, that's about all only so far, it's all I could figure out because this bad one goes to here, which goes to the speaker and which all goes through the output transformer as well. So, so far that's what I'm going with. Wire place this electrolytic, put in a new wire over to here, I double checked everything, resoldered the line from the center tap to all the negatives, I inject all the continuity to the wires connected to that wire, everything looks right. Let's see what happens when I hook it back up. So showers that we get in the evening will end overnight, high around 30. Right now it's 45 in Rock Hill, 41 in Gastonia, 43 in Charlotte. At WBT, we lead local. I'm Anna Erickson, WBT News. Get rid of nagging joint pain without unnecessary surgery or downtime. Hi, I'm Matt Doherty. I've suffered with back and joint pain for 40 years. As a player and coach, I love statistics. And here are a few for you to consider. I've learned that 80% of stem cell franchises are owned by someone without a medical background, where you won't even see a medical doctor. 80%. Yeah, we're going to try is put these little felt pads between the speaker and the cabinet. As right now, there's no cushioning between the metal frame of the speaker and the wood. So if the speaker is vibrating, it's just amplified through the wood. So I'm going to try that. Maybe that'll soften it up just a little bit. It may not cure it, but at least it won't be as, as bad. I'll give that a try. Take the COVID test, not be vaccinated. No. Stop. 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 